moments of Matako Machika where we shall have no what was up. Point of Matako Machika is going big for his 10th anniversary with another film, Opar Ginash, who continued to dark tell the stunned anime fans around the world back in 2011. But let's be real, there were plenty of tells early and on, on in the series. We should have known the praise ourselves, but the greatness was just too much. Hindsight is 20 to 20. Over 20, though, so here were just a few moments earlier in which we really should have guessed that something dark was coming. In some cases, some of us did. Good for us. He'll be handing out wishes. It is a true un universally acknowledged that free wishes are us. There's always a catch, whether it's a monkey's paw scenario or a wishmaster scenario. And Kiwi's setup in Matako Magica was extra suspicious. You get to be a cool magical girl in exchange for also getting a wish. Obviously, we're not blaming anyone who took this offer. Kiwi has a way of finding people who really are desperate for a miracle. The so desperate, they're not likely to consider the lucidness of his deal. And with the audience, do they have to hang up? At least I hope we don't. Did you feel something was up with Kiwi's deal? Or did they trick you too? Now I means happiness and having friends. On a scale of 3 days to retirement, though I'm going to my kid's birthday party, how hard did mommy jinx herself? The big sister magical girl of Matako Machika kick started the show's dark timeline in episode 3, whether she intended to or not, it felt like she did, whether we knew, knew it was coming or not, it probably all wins a little at mommy's exc exclamation. She was way too happy to finally having true friends, there was no way the kind of happiness was going to go unchecked, not in anime. At least, she had friends for a little while, and in other timelines. The lack of early information, we talked not long ago, about how Jen Orobuchi was just never mentioned when Matako Majiko first started getting press. In fairness, the guy has a career such as his presses and the project brings with certain expectations, so it retains shock value, he has to stay a secret, but the early magazine spreads for the series were extremely cute and extremely stereotypical, almost too much so. It's fun to look back at his retrospective. Which is back, because you can almost see how hard Shaft was working to hide their big secret. This is me, we should be wary of any enemy that harvests is as cute and harmless. Well, no, but maybe also, yes, whatever Wobber Ganache no brings. If you build in all the strangest that has come before, this time, hopefully, we forewarned. Hopefully.